This is one of the mysteries of Gobekli Tepe. The entire population there were hunter-gatherers. They were not agriculturalists, generating those supposed surpluses that would allow experts in architecture to emerge. They were hunter-gatherers. And how, in God's name, do a group of hunter-gatherers wake up one morning and create something like this, this, this enormous scale? And then the mystery deepens, because at the same time that they're building the megalithic site, they're also suddenly doing agriculture. I actually don't think that this was something that was just dreamed up overnight by a group of hunter-gatherers. I think I'm looking at a transfer of technology. I think people came to that site who already knew how to do this stuff.